If you've been following me for some time, you would know my hair has never been this short. And that's because on May 1st of 2023, y'all, I shaved off all of my hair. This is seven months now worth of growth and it's growing so good. It's not all different textures. It's not broken off. It's not shedding. I cut my hair for a lot of reasons. I wanted to show y'all how it's looking and I'm about to show y'all how I'm going to make this work with two inches of hair. One day I was just looking at my hair in the mirror and I really believed that I could braid my hair down. And as you can see, I did. If you're not a braider, you can put your hair in twists or even a low ponytail if your hair is long enough. One thing that I am learning going back completely natural from scratch is really making sure that I have enough moisture. So before styling, make sure that you mist your hair. That way it's not super dry and we don't have any breakage. Here I'll be applying my edge control to make sure that my parts are clean and just making sure that my whole section is nice and slick before braiding. Today's video is sponsored by Betterland. They sent me over 20 inches of 3B, 3C kinky curly clippings. One bundle is enough for a full head. It's super full. The curls are just so beautiful, especially once you brush them out. Now, I tried to brush it out as a whole, like bundle, but it was too much of a workout. So I went ahead and I just took it apart and did one by one to make sure I was able to brush out each weft. So, so it should look like this once it's all brushed out like a little fro and now we're just going to apply them to the back but first we're going to go ahead and remove the wraps so we can look at those crispy braids y'all see them all right i'm about to apply my west and it's pretty self-explanatory
Now it's time for the no leave out part. Using a small straight pin, I'm going to go ahead and grab some of the hair from the first weft and I'm going to scoop and I'm gonna tuck underneath that last weft and it's gonna make it look like the hair is coming from my scalp basically. And this is what it should look like once we are all done. It looks like it's coming straight up the scalp. Now it's time to define the curls. All right, babes, here's the finishing look. All the information on these exact clip-ins is in the description below. All the products and tools that I use is also down below. I hope you babes enjoy. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe if you haven't already. And I